Hi guys, welcome to another vlog this week. Um, in this vlog, I'll be showing you what we've been doing. Um, the septic tank people have come and put the provisional septic tank in for us and also um, the plumbing work that's been done and just a few things that has been going on. So um, I hope you're going to enjoy it. Um, I'm sitting here in, in my bathroom at the, and this is on the windowsill here. And if you look over there, in the distance is Limoges city center. So I wanted to share that with you because I thought it's such a lovely place to sit here and just contemplate the world. I've just seen a spider running up. Yeah, it's a little spider. Anyway, so I hope you enjoy the vlog and I'll catch you at the end. The guys are here for the septic tank. They're just delivering. I'm going to show you now. Yeah, they are. I'm going to deliver off the septic tank. Bonjour! delivered oui. off this tank which they are going to put at the bottom here temporary and dig the holes and let the septic tank we can use that as a temporary septic tank until September until September then they'll come and put the proper one in I thought it's just absolutely amazing that they're helping us so we got something proper here at the moment we've just got an old septic tank and it only the only two people staying in the chateau at the moment but now we can have more people so that's great we are gonna go, eh? okay. this is they did <laughs> dumping the digger <laughs> wow all the action going on at the moment here I've never seen this happening this way. Usually the back of a truck and then it rides off. Wow. Easy peasy. Voila, now they've got it all off, he just unhooks that, perfect, let's drive that one off and then it goes back up again. Voila. This morning, to my surprise, the volunteer made this beautiful book sh a shelving unit, so we can put the stuff for the garage in here, for the time being, so we can lose some space in the pantry, so we can get the pantry working. Well done, Paulus. Thank yes, you. Paulus, fitting the basins into the dresser for my bathroom. I'm so excited. Thank you, Paulus. You're doing an amazing job. So meticulous. Lovely. Thank you. And the plumber will be arriving soon and he will do all the connections. Great. So we've got the stands ready for the showers and we're getting the taps in. Thanks to the insulation guys, they went and put the tap things in the wrong place. So now we've got to rectify all their mistakes. Anyway, it'll soon be done and this train will be yeah. busy putting on the stands for the shower. The stabilizing footings. Yes, that's right. We've measured yeah. them all out. Yeah. I don't know how well you can see all the marks, but they've all been marked out according to the plate. Yeah, and that's the plate in the back of the shower. And we've got the basins in to the for my dre in the dresser, and they connected, and he'll be putting the taps in soon. So yeah, I'm all excited about getting these bathrooms working soon. There's Paula's taking down all the wood from the one room we're cleaning out, which is down the corridor here. We're busy cleaning everything. This is the other room in the apartment. So we're getting everything sorted out in preparation 
of decorating for the next two weeks. So it feels so great. We're slowly getting there. And we've got the one basin in at the moment. They're not yet finished with everything. The bath has been moved to the other side and we're just getting on. And that will go into the salon, winter salon. So chuffed. Now we're moving on with the decorating. Right, the kitchen's all been insulated. <clears throat> we're gonna start the floors and paint the walls before they put the kitchen in. Here, if I go down, I've cleaned up my room and we're gonna start the insulation on these walls, the outside walls, and in the winter salon in there. I'm going to start the floors in here and paint what I need to paint around here. And then I want to, I'm thinking of putting a big mural over here. The shower goes over there. So I want to put a large mural here and there will be tiles over there then. And then we have the dresser in and I need to get the floors done. I should have done the floors there first, but things were so hectic, I just couldn't get there. And then we'll get the insulation done in the other room against the outside wall. So we'll get that done and then we'll start decorate, doing this floor and decorating it and the corridor as well. We've just got to get that closed up and then that's the corridor going down to the west wing. We're in the east side. I've just bought these lovely flowers from the money I received from buy me a coffee and then I purchased this as well these flowers here and planted them in and I'd like to share with everybody who bought me a coffee what I've done well, if you look at the house now, most of the ivy's down that we could get down. And it looks absolutely lovely. So we've still got some of the dried ones to pull down, but we'll get there in time. And then also, I forgot to share with you, I bought these begonias as well with the, um, money from buy me a coffee and i've put them out here here's the begonias that i bought with the money from buy me a coffee so i'm busy kind of put some little herbs in there for the kitchen and yeah, the flowers look very nice. The others were contributions from Brigitte. And yeah, we're slowly getting there. The shutters have been pressure washed. The doors have been pressure washed. The door shutters have been pressure washed as well. 
slowly we're getting there one step at a time well i hope you've enjoyed the vlog that i've made for you and um hopefully next week we've got a few things going on but just keep in mind now um i'm going to be just doing a, a bit of decorating we're going to start with the decorating in the kitchenette um and also in i'm standing in the grand salon in the winter salon um which is going to have the floors done and the walls painted so we're going to get this ready as well as the two bedrooms and the two bathrooms we're going to do the floors so um i hope you enjoy that for next week i just want to apologize for being late unfortunately we've had a bereavement in the family and um, it just hurt my heart a lot and um yeah that's just what's happened so um life goes on and we just need to move ahead as and enjoy life every day that we have to me it's a gift and i i really i really mean it everybody should look at life every day as a gift and when you wake up to me it's so important when i wake up i so, get so excited to see what happens good or bad and we learn from it as we go along in life and to all those that bought me a coffee thank you very very much and i've showed you the flowers that i've bought from that money just to brighten up the house a little bit and it's just um, so lovely when i tend them in the mornings and go and look at them in the evenings i give them some water it really gives me great pleasure and i want to thank everybody for subscribing and giving me all those likes and wonderful comments and um, it's just I just feel the love coming from everybody and thank you so much from the bottom of my heart I thank everybody for what they've done thank you and I'll catch you on the next vlog bye for now